So we've got like a two-tone dulcimer happening here. Where yeah. On the left here is what, well, almost what was. That's all dried, gone black varnish. Right. And um, which was originally on there. Which yeah. was painted on yeah. some. I don't know what sort of varnish, but it's gone very black and very dark. And uh, rather than leave it because it's not very nice it's it's lumpy it's sticky and that's the original wood underneath it which is how it would have looked once they finish it and that will polish up like looks still like Jarrah just taking it off gently it, it slowly comes up okay. and smooths off the and you, you've putted over a couple of these screws here they were already putted yeah. over oh, yeah they? that was okay. all part of it you see there and that's right and so all the some were putted in. and some weren't were yeah they? so and with the pegs here yeah. they're not too bad they every one of them moves and they're really nice and tight i'm not sure about straightening them i'm not too sure that they were all straight David. i wouldn't bother straightening them no. i think you're likely to cause more problems yeah. than they'll get to, fix, they'll get too big they won't sit yeah properly. that's right back in between I suddenly found wow you know like this one is interesting this as one goes through there but this one's got one that seems to hit that and go there and it goes that side and I think he's taken that that string off there and put it on this side because it was hitting that but there's definitely been a string set up in there so you've removed that nasty screw down there. Yeah, that was pretty, pretty hideous. It was ugly, wasn't it? No. <laughs> it was horrible. Was and when I cut my there. finger on it, I decided uh, oh, really? it needed Sorry to be removed. It's a good reason to remove things, I think. Yeah, so this is starting to... And you've got the two lines still showing, which is good. Where the bridges were. Yeah. And I've got something for the bridge. That would be nice oh, okay. for the bridge. By the time I've cut it back down, it's hard. I don't know what it is. It's either Australian oak or okay. something like that. But it's very hard. Where did you get it from? I uh, found it. It's a piece of tip. Wood. Oh, yeah. <laughs> tip wood's good. <laughs> so, together and holes drilled and that sort of stuff. You can see where. A little tiny line they first scribed a circle and then moved it to there and then the same on this one they were going to do a big circle decided not to put a smaller circle in moved it and then finished with those four Fantastic. holes so and once all the old varnish and dirt and everything else has got off it um, the wood starts to come up looking much mm, better okay. So you've, and it you've shows sanded all. this down, you put what you've one lot... I sanded it down and then I scraped it scraped with, it, with yeah. a board scraper and then I put oil on, just um, it's just an orange oil that Dated you that put on for of wood, it, it, yeah. it seals the wood and it actually improves the wood itself and then what I'll do yeah. is I'll wax it. Cleaned up these, wax. Yes, they which they come up. up very nice, they look and like we newish. Need just need still some waiting ones. on some pieces yep. and I see one of the pin blocks you've oiled as well yeah, to see what colour and how it came up. I quite like it because it's retaining that sort of old, it's not a new piece, it's, it's sure. quite old and you can see all the wear and tear on things, which I think is quite nice. As opposed to the other pin block here. Which I haven't, I've only just started yeah. to clean up. So. Which it even still looks better than what, what it was. So. Oh, I think so. So yeah, we're, pretty, we're so. well on the way, it looks nice. Yeah. It looks nice.